Absolutely, man. To be standing here on the red carpet is is uh is more than incredible, man. Just it's, in a nutshell, I'm from Montgomery, Alabama. Montgomery, Alabama is not the dance central of the world, you know. So it's uh it's a, it's a story of stepping out on faith and just and 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 hoping to God that something would happen. And, belief in my body and uh, it, it's literally brought me here man it, it's just a matter of never giving up and working super hard and being as knowledgeable as I can and uh, you know that, that that's it in a nutshell so it feels incredible it feels rewarding and it's fuel for what's next hey what's going on y'all this is twitch and you're watching black tree TV open up the cages boys show these newbies what we call this is vault In it, in double meaning, mm -hmm. it's a dream team that it's our dream come true, mm -hmm. and it's a dream dream team that we all have this much talent in the same room. Right, right. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Now, now 3D. I mean, did y'all have to actually like do moves, particularly because y'all knew it was in 3D, like as opposed to, you know, like all right, it's just a 2D film. Did y'all? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Of course. I mean, um, John Chu definitely had direction and a vision and focus. And, um, you know, uh, before screening, they, they definitely had to do tests and stuff like that. Y'all had to what, turn the TVs around yeah, and where to, yeah, where to, around yeah. and put the glasses on right there. And we had to test it out and mm -hmm. see what worked, mm -hmm. what didn't work. Right. And um, lastly, I know, like, you know, between Step Up 2 campaign, this, we lost one of the greatest entertainers all time with Michael Jackson. Mm -hmm. um, I, I don't see his his music being replicated, but I do see like dancers coming out. Are there dancers that are on that that, that are getting to that level? Like this is gonna be, you know, just a superstar dancer that's gonna stand above the rest. Are, are, are these people that's coming out of these camps? That well, I mean. I don't know about um, stand above the rest. I mean, I know that the, the dance uh, market is highly competitive and stuff like that, but I think one of the greatest things about true artists and true freestylers and true dancers is they, they kind of own, uh, they own their own spot in the sky as far as stars go, you know what I mean? Yeah, so yeah. It's, not, it's not like either one of us are better than each other. We just we do our thing just like we do it, you know what I mean, right, right. like as an individual. So. Yeah. I appreciate your time, and everybody's gonna go enjoy Step Up Three. Yay! Y'all yeah, keep on doing your thing. We'll keep on watching. Thank, Thank you so you much, much, man. Appreciate Thank it. you. Appreciate it. That was really good, bro. Yeah. So, I mean, I, just when I thought I was through with 3D, <laughs> this movie right here, I mean, if 3D was made for anything, it was made for Step Up Revolution. I mean, I, I've never seen a movie where 3D really fit like that, and, and dance really is the is the platform for that. So it, it was great. Y'all had some great performances. How how was that for you guys? I know y'all have been dancing and choreographing for a while, but how was the, the flash mob? Has that been something that y'all participated in before? There's not. I've, I've never participated in the flash mob. I mean, I've, I've seen them, you know, I've seen them on YouTube, and I've seen them, like, like footage of them. I've never actually seen one in real life until Step Up Revolution, so I, 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 my experience with flash mobs was only <laughs> just from seeing them online, yeah, you know, yeah. and I thought, they lo I thought they looked pretty cool, but I, I thought it was really... I thought it was really clever what the franchise did with it because they didn't stop at just having flash mobs. Just um, you know, they they actually have a lot of dancers that can handle intricate choreography and right. staging to make these these visuals look just just 
ridiculous. Um, the 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 business plaza scene where everybody's in suits and stuff mm-hmm. like that. The uh, the the staging alone on that, along with like the moves that were being done, it's a lot. Of, it's a lot of in and out and all this stuff like that. And the visual of that is just incredible. So it's not a lot of people just standing in one place yeah. and and doing a ripple effect where you know yeah. you just kind of follow the line and stuff like that. You have your own choreography track, you know, yeah, and yeah. it all adds in. And I, I thought that was great. You're watching Black Tree on TV. Only on Soul of the South. We're back. I'm your host, Alex Hudgens, and you are watching Black Tree on TV, your number one source for urban entertainment. Now it's time for us to catch up with current day Twitch as he talks about the brand spanking new Step Up, Step Up All In, with our girl Justice Jones. Justice? In opening scenes of the movie, the dancers face a lot of rejection. So as a dancer yourself, how do you deal with rejection in the industry? Honestly, you just gotta take it with a little bit of thick skin, or, or a lot of bit of thick skin, actually. When it comes to this industry, it's very competitive. Um, it can be a little cutthroat when you're dealing with certain people. So with that, if you love what you do, um, which I do, I, I love what I do, I love entertaining people, I love making people smile, and I love dancing to music, you know what I mean? So sometimes you gotta take uh, rejection with a grain of salt, you know, and, and just move on to the next one, because look, there's infinite shine, and there's infinite possibility to shine. You just gotta be resilient and persevere, and it'll happen for you. I hear you. And it is a very competitive industry, like you said before, but you have been successful in many aspects of it. You're acting and you're dancing. So tell me where that transition came in for you from dancing to acting. Uh, from dancing to acting, I have to say it, uh, it happened uh, through the Step Up films, actually. I was in Step Up 3D, um, where I was offered the role as Jason, um, and they, they had them fleshed out. It wasn't it wasn't just like the, the you know, the line here or there. I had actually had a, an opinion and, and, a, and a view on life, which was amazing. So that I think from there, that was the, the standpoint. And then right after that, I did uh, Stomp the Yard Homecoming, where I got to play a bit of a bad guy, which was different you know what yeah. i mean so it's just like yeah, that was the transition point and now i'm really uh pressing in towards the acting a lot taking classes auditioning you know what i mean i love it i love it that's great that's great so i do love your dance moves and i want to know when you're out at like a club at night or something do you really get down with your choreography or kind of or do you just do your little one two step okay yeah let me di- let me dispel a myth real quick okay <laughs> let me dispel a myth all right, so, you know, to be able to dance, that's great. It is the least sexy thing for a guy to sweat through your dress shirt at the club. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't care how well you can dance. If you look like you got a see-through shirt on mm-hmm. that buttons up, yeah. you're out of the game. You're out, you know? And I learned that the hard way, you know what I mean? Uh, you try to be impressive, but it's not impressive being nasty, you know what I'm saying? So I stay to a one-two step, Okay. you know, that's okay. about it. I've learned to let go of the battles in the club, you know, and not show out too hard, because that's, that's not what it's about. Yeah, because I sweat a lot, and my sweat has an odor to it, too, so oh, no. it's just like, I, I know, exactly. See your face, you're like, oh, no. Now imagine it actually just being in front of you, like, hey, you, you want to dance or nah? Nah, you don't, okay, yeah. <laughs> Twitch is the man. Seriously though, who needs moves like Jagger when you can do all that? You go boy. Thanks Justice. Still ahead. We are having a sex tape draft. And we take you to the red carpet premiere of sex tape in Los Angeles. Don't miss it here and right here only on Black Tree on TV. You're watching Black Tree on TV. Only on Soul of the South.